Hey guys, Technometry with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys a trick to get your iPhone to speak the text to you and read it back to you. This is text to speech recognition, which a lot of people don't know about. And it's a really helpful and handy, useful tool that you can use on your iPhone or iPad if you're reading a book or if you're browsing online or looking at your notes, whatever it is, it really makes life much more easier, especially if you're editing something on it, having someone read it back to you, you can quickly recognize any kind of reading error or proofread it. And we're going to show you guys how to do that. But before we go ahead and get started, if you guys are new to the channel, we do a lot of tech news reviews and giveaways. So make sure that that subscribe button. Also, if you guys are in the market for one of the phenomenal devices at a discounted price make sure you guys check out the link in the description section so without further ado let's go ahead and get started the first thing to turn on text to speech uh recognition mode you want to do is go into settings and once you're in your setting you want to go scroll to accessibility once you're in accessibility menu you're going to locate spoken content you want to click on that and the option you'll see is speak selection you want to enable that once you have enabled that what's going to happen is let's show you guys in this in action so as you can see in the note we have some text and we want this text to be spoken back to us so to do that we can simply highlight this by holding our pointer down once you have highlighted that you'll notice a new option where it says speak and if we click on Your that iphone to take great shots in any situation from a candid photo to a studio quality portrait, you. As you can see, the iPhone is now actually reading the text for us and that's how you get that. And now to enhance your experience, you can actually have a custom way to be able to read the screen and much more with it. And to do that, you wanna turn on speak screen control. And once you have done that, you're gonna to want to enable speak controller by selecting that and then show controller you notice this little controller pop up with multiple options of course this one is to read when you put that play button uh, this is actually you're able to control the speed at the pace that the person is speaking back and this pointer you can select the specific stuff so let's click on this show controller on as the you can see here it is reading everything on the screen, screen. And, and then we can also pause it fast forward or rewind or click a specific section the speech controller allows quick access and it will read out that specific expand part and then we can pause it as well and we can also control the control the brightness of this by toggling it on and much more you can also do is go here and you'll notice there's a couple options of course you can play around with these options this one is important because you'll see speaking rates so if you want the speak to be very fast you want to go all the way up here or if you want to do slow you want to go to the turtle in the middle is just the just about the same here and you'll see pronunciation here as well you can add special pronunciation and also select the different languages that are available a very cool feature that is here that for you to do and as you can see we'll go ahead and show you guys how this will work so if you go here we're over here let's say we want them to read this we're going to select the finger point when you use the device or and as you battery, can see we just pointed to that part warm. and it will start reading from there the whole text and this is really cool especially if you are reading a book or if you're editing something and you want and that text to be spoken to you see to make sense of what you're writing to catch any kind of error and such so hopefully this video is helpful for you guys if this video is helpful please make sure to hit that uh, like and subscribe button and thanks for watching guys see you guys next time